All right, gang, and welcome to Plexus. So today what I want to talk to you about is shifting the paradigm. And when I say shifting the paradigm, there are three types of audits that are largely called out in the ISO, say, and IETF standards. You've got system audits, process audits, and product audits. Now, here's where I want you to shift the paradigm. Most of you, when you plan your audit program, will go through and plan your system audits, followed by process. And the one that gets the least amount of attention is your product audits. But here's the paradigm that I need you to shift. Does the customer most directly come in contact with your system? No. Does the customer come in contact with your process? Also no. The customer most directly comes into contact with your product. And most of us have this wrong. So what I am gonna challenge you to do, put the product on the pedestal. The product audits are your early detection system for process and system. And if you get this through your head and you kind of walk it through backwards, your product is created by process and your process is guided by system. Think of it this way. You've heard the term where there's smoke, there's fire, right? So think of the product as the smoke. The product is the thing the customer comes in contact with. And when you're planning your program, you need to most specifically cover the aspects of the product that the customer is going to interact with. And then from there, you can plan your attack for your processes and your systems. This is completely different from what you might be used to. And I wanna challenge you at this point to shift your thinking because if you put the product first and then define your process and your system audits from there, you will have a much better experience, you'll be much more efficient, and the best thing is you'll be much more effective. All right, if you'd like more on auditing, how to strategize out of programs, or anything else related to IETF, AS, ISO, pretty much anything system-wise, core tool-wise, check out plexusinternational.com for more tips, tools, and tricks, and we'll see you in the next one.